for joining. So it's autumn, we're in the woods and it's foggy. So I think it can actually get better than this. So I've not been uh, not been making any videos for quite a while and um, I'm a little bit rusty, so to speak. Now I have found a little scene, it's a very, very intimate scene with a very, very young couple of little trees and just trying to capture some of the colour really. And then obviously the fog, it's just adding just such depth and just foggy and just beauty. So, little scene, I'm just having a little wander around and I'll uh, stick these one on screen for you. Um, I did have plans for a scene a little bit further up, um, but there's a, there's a new mine that's being built and it's just absolutely manic for noise up there. So I've come this way for, um, well, for more peace and quiet, but yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous. Check this out. Look at this fog. That is absolutely insane. <sighs> right, so I've just been scouting a little woodland. I don't know if I got a shot, I don't think I did. Um, I'm just gonna start frog marching and then any scenes pop along, I'll, um, I'll be straight with you. Um, I've not been putting out many videos lately just been absolutely manic. So I had the uh, contract with the North Yacht Mars, which was uh, absolutely epic. Um, and then I had a couple of gigs, restaurants, that sort of thing. So I've just been sort of consumed with that. Um, but it means good news. Things are picking up. So I've managed to get myself another camera. Um, so I've got the uh, Z6 II and the Z7 II now. So that's a couple of cameras, um, primarily it's for a backup camera really and I wanted a dedicated video camera so it's going to be uh, be pretty cool for the channel. I've also got a three legged thing, a Winston. Um, I haven't put any sort of reviews together because <sighs> I haven't had a chance to try her out. Uh, but first impressions, she's a big beast. Um, she goes to about seven foot high and just, uh, well, I'm, uh, I'm just trying to work out a situation with the bag at the moment because just a bit tall. Um, I've ordered one off um, Wex video. I can't remember what they call it now, but it's a flip side. I think it's a flip side. I don't know. I'll put the name of it there. Uh, so that should be coming in the next couple of days. Um, yeah, Z6 II as well. So it's sort of got less megapixels, but um, it's got better low light performance and the video um, quality is exceptional. It can shoot in 10 bit for video, which is what I wanted. But the only problem is you're gonna, I'm gonna need an, um, I'm gonna need a external monitor, which is uh, no bloody good. Just checking the woodland out actually. Uh, it's only a little one. Let's just see how it is. Go and have a little nosy, see what's what. Yeah, so we've got a couple of cameras now, which is pretty good. And um, I've got the foggiest 
idea of how to vlog with a with a camera without a twisty screen so I've invested in a little mirror for it because I think that'll help me at least when you can see yourself you know you're in frame and stuff like that so um, yeah so I'm gonna head over to a scene uh, that I've shot before I'll pop that on screen um, so it was nice and snowing and absolutely stunning uh, the last time I was there I just wanted to see if I could catch it in sort of foggy, autumny, sort of, uh, yeah, you get the drift. Um, so it's a little bit of a walk back on a main road. What, what can you do? Um, yeah, when we get there, I'll be back with you. After much deliberation, it turns it turns out it was a bit easier than uh, than I was than when I was making it. Uh, just needed to find a gate, but we have her in our sights. So we'll do a winter and then oh I'll do an autumn and then a winter um, one for this, and then I'm going to keep moving because it's uh, pissing it down. Check these out. Yeah, the winter one though, if I'm honest. Uh, a bit of snow does wonders, doesn't it? Uh, so I'm gonna mooch on now, see if I can find something else and get off this road. Because uh, everybody that's driving past me is frowning at me. And I can sort of work out things like you idiot and that sort of thing being said from lip reading. So, yeah. Perfect. <laughs> that was another one. Aye. It's a fast road and it is foggy. Eh, don't try this at home, guys. Oh, that would be a nice little shot there. Aye, fog's coming in a bit strong now, it is. Um, need it to lift ever so slightly it's quite nice though different world isn't it when there's fog about um, it's a good job I know where I am and all but yeah we'll keep moving you ever start feeling that that moment of despair and then you start thinking like ah what am I doing why am I even out here and I'm not getting any photos and then you start thinking about giving up and then you're presented with a scene dead simple so we just got sort of like the side of uh, the valley going into Eskdale and um, I'll show you on the other camera um, I'll pop it on now. Uh, just sort of been emphasising on the uh, diagonal lines on the scene and then obviously the fog is just throwing in some really nice sort of depth from the layers of the trees. Um, I didn't realise but there's actually a house further up as I'm just looking at it now so that might be a potential for a shot as well. Yeah. They always say slow down and just get, get be a bit more still and things will pop out and 
that's exactly what's happened. So I didn't even notice the back layer. Too busy in my own waller of thoughts of giving up and then presented with a very complex scene. And I've got my 24 to 200 on, so I can really tuck in. And then even if needs be, I can go into DX mode and tuck in even further and add it to about, I think it gives you, get me up to about 300 milli millimetres. I'm staying put here for a moment or two. Beautiful. I'll, uh, I'll pop one of these on screen for you now. I ran into you Do you need a picture? 